Right guys, you join me at a time where we're going to do the ultimate world to glory, but I've just attempted to do one run, knocked out in the first round after a complete bullshit game. It was a bad team as well, didn't really enjoy the team we did get, and uh, unfortunately we're being kicked out. So we've wasted 15,000 coins, which is a little bit annoying. The record's not looking good, and hopefully we can get something decent from these packs. So if you guys do want any MSP, PSN codes, or cheap game codes, go and check out G2A.com, their link is down below. If we can try and hit over 5,000 likes, that'd be sick, and also subscribe if you're not subscribed already. So we're going to take away from these packs we're going to see what we can keep um the contracts i might just sell actually and hopefully we can uh, um we can flip them for for some for literally 200 coins but yeah um a frustrating fucking foot draft that was it was a it was a pretty crap foot draft as well um not even full chemistry and that annoyed the shit out of me how much did these even go for these go for like three 300 yeah 300 on these um so this up for 300. We'll keep that and then we'll just discard the rest, I think. Um, absolutely shit foot draft that was. Really annoyed me. Um, and unfortunately, we've uh, lost 15,000 coins, which is also absolutely brilliant. Unable to pack anything decent in the packs. A Marvy potentially could sell because... Um, is a decent little yeah he goes for over over discard so we'll get rid of him and I'm just gonna sort them out after the after the video actually I've uh, I've just decided I'm a little bit little bit annoyed you know that you know when you get to them stages where you're just really annoyed at FIFA and uh, this patch just doesn't seem to be uh, to be cutting me hopefully we get a decent lone legend though that'd be absolutely sick if we can get a lone legend um, oh Tony Cruz Schweinsteiger unfortunately can't use him but we will keep him uh, in the club discard the rest and that's another 600 coins. So, yeah, absolutely uh, awesome. So, anyway, guys, let's go and blow another 15,000 on foot draft. And uh, that was one of the entries down. So, we've got to online, online draft, 15,000 coins. And hopefully, we get something dealt a little bit better. Um, even a better formation. We get, Like, look at the fucking state of these formations. <sighs> no wingers. No wingers. Oh, oh wait, there. we've got a 4-1-2-1-2. I'm going to take the 4 one 2 one 2 I think. Um... Hopefully a decent... Right. I'm going to take Messi. Obviously, you can't, you can't not take Messi. Left mid, hopefully, Ronaldo or Neymar. Neither, but we do get Costa. Uh, I'm going to take Costa, even if I have to use him as a super sub. Uh, striker. No one from La Liga. No one from La Liga. So we're going to take Bundesliga. No Bundesliga. Fuck my life. This The state of this draft already, guys. Right, we get Benzema. There we go. Even though we could take Lewandowski, but I'm going to take Benzema. Because last time I used Benzema, he actually fucking did alright for me in, in draft. Uh, Cam, De Bruyne, would love to take De Bruyne. Like, fucking hell, how hard is it to mix up Brazilian Coutinho? That's what I'm thinking here, to link with Costa. Oh, the state of this already. Krychoyak, thank you. Centre-back. Glick, Matthew, ooh, take Matthew, I actually really do like Matthew, and right back, like, like what, like what am I going to do with this shit, this is just a mix of fucking bullshit, we get a keeper which I've got last time and actually lost of him, which is Lux, and I'm hoping the bench is going to be filled, oh, wow, wow, Fucking hell. Is this the worst draft you have ever seen on YouTube? Right, Felipe Luis. I'm going to take him. He's Brazilian. Oh, my God. We've got loads of shit to start out here. Starting with a goalkeeper. And we've still not fucking got a decent goalkeeper. But I'm going to take Farman. Uh, just because I know he's good. And probably end up bringing him on as a sub. Alaba, Alba, left back. Right, they're all left backs. So, I'm going to take... Marcello, because Real Madrid, even though Alba's a bit... Now, nah, Marcello, I'm going to take Mar Marcello there. Um, left back, left back, centre back, right back. Fucking hell. Left wing back, but actually, Debucci, doesn't he? He links with... Debucci links with Matthew, which is a little bit better. Um, Sterling, Gaetan, Inter. This might be, end up being a Brazilian team, I think. I think it might end up being somewhat Brazilian. Willian, as well. It's pointing me in the direction of Willian. Even though we've got Conor Plianca. I'm going to take Conor Plianca to hopefully save face. And potentially aim to get La Liga. We've not got a lot of positions to choose from, to be honest. Royce, Pedro, Kalu, Fal Hernandez. Um, 
I'm thinking Rice for, for, for Super Striker. That's what I'm thinking. That's what I'm thinking. Because the rest of this... I might play a Perez at Cam. I might play a Perez at Cam, I think. Maybe. I don't know. Hopefully, I don't have to because he's not really an attacking type of player. We get Wendell, um, who is Brazilian and would, get, would actually get a strong link. We could play Messi up front. Um, Going to take Wendell. Potentially might be able to use him to link with uh, Douglas Costa. Iniesta, he might have to go Cam. Yeah, I'm going to take Iniesta in there, whack him there. And then we'll sort some out, I think. I think we'll have to sort. This team is a mess. Like, a superstar striker would go down a tree here. Yeah? Derm at left back. He would get a perfect link to Royce, actually. Even though that was probably a bad mistake. Valdez. Goethe. Look at the state of this. We need... Oh my god, we need a centre back. And I've not took one, I've been avoiding centre backs. Have we got anyone on the bench who's centre back? Marcello potentially could play centre back. Yeah, oh, this, fuck the state of this. And the final player is Sol. Or uh, Gonzalez, isn't it? I'm going to have to take Gonzalez. So, yeah, right, Gonzalez. Right, guys, I'm going to sort this shit out. Hopefully get it to 90 chemistry or higher. And hopefully go on a draft run. Because twice in a row, we've been dealt a shit draft. Right, guys, we've got it to 96 chemistry without a manager. Let's see who the manager is and go through the team. So, we need... Uh, we get to 98 with him. 97. 97. 97. Uh, and does the Brazilian... Nah, so it looks like we're going to go with a French manager just to get chemistry to Benzema. Um, but the team looks all right. Apart from the striker, we have got a very attacking team, 182 rating. Um, and what I'm looking to do, guys, is uh, potentially, well, I'm just playing Barrios there for chemistry. I can't see how I can make it any better. Like, it's gone down already doing that. So we're going to stick at 98. Barrios is going to come on for, Royce is going to play striker. Costa may appear. Farman's definitely going to appear because I don't trust that goalkeeper whatsoever. So... Let's get into the games, guys, and hopefully fucking win. So instantly, guys, with this draft, I did realise I need to take uh, take that fucking strike off as he was completely shit and do bring on uh, our man, Inform Royce, in the strike position. And we also change the goalkeeper to second informer, Inform Farman, who is a very, very good goalkeeper. Now, with the gameplay, and I am going to talk about this because yesterday's video was a rage video um, about the way the patch was. It actually, like, if you guys do watch my stream, which is twitch.tv forward slash bits 87 HD, there is a difference between Xbox and PlayStation currently. When I'm playing an Xbox, which obviously the Road to Glory you're seeing here, it is very sluggish, doesn't feel that good, and uh, annoys the shit out of me. Um, it's very, it, it's just really sluggish. Play on PlayStation, same team, it is fast, it is smooth, and I don't know what it is, but it's making me not like playing uh, FIFA on the Xbox, which is annoying, and even the goals and scoring are pretty crap. We take a 3-1 victory in the first round, which is a lot better than the last one, as we actually do progress through and out of the first round this time round, and I think I'm going to do that from now on guys we'll get knocked out in the first round the video's gonna get cancelled and i'll try again if i can afford so so in the next opponent of the draft I didn't actually show you the uh, the guy's team in the first round because i forgot to start recording uh, but this guy's got purple ronaldo um rodriguez benzema william ramirez a nice looking bpl um team uh, around it as well and uh, instantly people are able to run at me terrible defending there and he gets just able to run it into the back of the net and make it one nil now this was a draft where i was trying hard um and the opponents at the time of the day were really really fucking good so also guys you're going to see a little bit of a nice set piece play here if someone blocks the line honestly look for the uh, the person to pass to on the outside instantly do a through ball on the inside and you're basically going to gift yourself a goal if you guys have watched my videos religiously uh, which i presume a lot of you guys won't <laughs> you will see um you will see that free kick used a few times. Now, also, guys, I'm going to do a shameless plug as well. If you guys haven't checked out my Facebook page, go and check it out and uh, leave a like rating on it as well. I'm going to recuperate it. And if you guys do still use personal Facebooks and stuff like that, uh, you'll never be able to miss a video as I will be posting them uh, every day on there. So he makes it 2-2. Another shit defending by me, and it actually takes the game to extra time. Messi running on through there, went for a shot and got wiped out. Now, usually that type of penalty wouldn't be given, but it was. We are able to take it to 3-2 uh, in the 101st minute and Benzema getting on the score sheet. A nice little penalty. And that was how that game did finish. We now push on into the 
semi-final and uh, now we're going to be coming up against another nice looking team and I'm getting annoyed at it as well this is actually a good looking uh, BPL team with Inform Henderson Inform Mamsey Inform Coutinho Inform Mar second Inform Mares actually uh, Eden Hazard Costa that is a fucking awesome looking draft and I've never got a BPL team like it before I think even if I went La Liga I don't think I'd get a team like that we were able to break on through with Royce and just directly run at him he didn't bring anyone towards me so I was able to finesse that in the 65th minute I am playing very cautiously as well guys because the world to glory i am very keen on keeping the record looking nice but unfortunately because of the way i do play um we are losing a lot of games currently which is annoying we break through in the 72nd minute royce yet again clean on through and he has been a super sub every game so far he's able to finesse it in off the post and make it 2-0 the victory was basically sealed then as the opponent went on all out attack and this time around he looked like he stopped playing with that player in the uh center out position just stuck on the halfway line but benzema is able to run it basically into the back now panicked about getting caught so I just smashed it in and that was a 3-0 victory taking us into the final um I was obviously going to store the stats of that game, but it was just a basic 3-0 win. And as you can tell, guys, we've got no coin bonuses activated currently, and that is because we haven't locked any in the catalogue. So our final opponent, guys, we come up against a nice-looking team of Hero Ronaldo again. Uh, Muller, Lewandowski, Inform, um, De Bruyne, Inform, Gaia, Inform, Buffon, but the chemistry was a little bit down, which was one positive. And this was a game where, yet again, playing very, very cautiously, playing down the wing and looking to get the goals. Royce making a horrible mistake there getting tackled but he's able to rebound it into the back of the net and that's what I mean guys the game just doesn't look pretty it's not pretty but we are being able to scrape the wins we then break through in the 72nd minute Iniesta linking the ball onto Benzema and he puts it into the back of the net guys so that is the win let's go and have a look so here we are guys, a 2-0 victory and uh, that is us dealt with the final. Surprised actually after the run of the last game, a uh, very tight game actually it was and only at the end I was able to uh, move on through and get some decent... Um decent chances so we've got 40,000 coins overall in this process i've spent in the week i'm like down 25k so if we can make 25k off these packs i'm going to open them as well guys so we get a premium gold player pack which i think shit and a mega pack as well unless unless that's not a 50k pack wow 25k pack and a 35k pack so fingers crossed guys we're going to hit an inform like Di maria that would honestly take the series to another level please take the series to another level lich steiner a series is staying at the same level. We got closer. Um, we got players which could potentially sell, which I am going to list up. Even him, he's a good goalkeeper on the game. Uh, closer won't sell. Lulic may sell. We did actually buy him at the start of the series um, when we changed the team. So many bronzes. We'll keep uh, Humber and Peterson. We'll keep all the rare contracts as well. And I think we may potentially um, have some uh, decent stuff there so we've got liverpool away kit which i will sell because even though i'm a liverpool fan i know i can make money on that kit uh stadium badge may sell never even seen that badge before that one um shield may sell for the goalkeeper lichsteiner may sell now but with it being footmas it may may not so we're going to discard discard the rest as it is all uh, complete shit and now we need to make still 20 twenty thousand coins off this pack alone we need to hit an inform or a legend the pie yes that's actually a good one we might have made our money back on that just because of the pie i'm not oh nah 22k he's gonna go for about 10 8k 10k that one's not first owner potentially we could sell him for 10 um but yeah we hit the pie that's not bad. I'm going to list him up. Is that, is that a fresh one at 9.8? Yeah, I think I'm going to list him up for like 9.8 and um, take the coins instantly because his price is going to plummet over the next couple of days as well, down to about 7, 8k, I reckon. So I'll list him up for 9 9.6. 9.7 is an instant bin, I think. Probably won't sell instantly, uh, but at least it's there. Cerner as well is a good utility player, very good all round player. Does it even sell for? Oh, wow. Well, we'll list him for 750. Um, fingers crossed he sells. There's no one else in there I can see sell. Bemba, sweaty BPL defender, goes. Does he sell? Does he sell? Does he sell? Does he sell? Sell? Let's have a look. Some might be price fixing him by the looks of that. Um, Cassian and open 650. Yeah, so he goes for 650 minimum anyway. Um, get rid of him. No one, no one, no one, no one, no one, no one, no one. And that's that pack done. So we probably made about potentially about 60 uh, 60k back 
that's the risk we took in draft. The next episode, guys, we are going to be nailing divisions, as you can see there. We've got four games left. Need to hammer divisions, and the only way to do that is to get on the horse and get into Division 1. Get Division 1 done, then it's 100% draft throughout this series. So, guys, leave a like rating, subscribe if you're not, and we'll be back another day with another video for you guys to enjoy.